Hello and welcome to this uh, brief video on the use of short stories in teaching medical undergraduates. This is from the Medical Humanities course in the junior cycle, junior cycle one, that's first year students at RCSI Pradana. I'm Professor Anthony Cummins. So we're going to use two stories about a character called Our Girl. One is called Where Is Our Girl? And the second is called Our Girl is in a Relationship. These are from the work of Mark de Fuita. Mark de Fuita is an Irish writer now living in Langkawi. He has lived outside of Ireland since 1989, in Brussels, in France, in the UK, in India, and for the last approximately eight to nine years in Malaysia. He's married to a Malaysian woman and lives in Langkawi. He has written several short stories, one of which was included in this collection called Lost in Putrajaya, and more recently this year in A Little Basket and of New Malaysian Writing. And his other collection is all his own short stories in the book Tropical Madness, from which the two stories about Agar come. The stories about Agar are interesting in that they are laid out exactly like a series of Facebook entries. They're poignant, sad, and funny at times. So let's look at the first one in a moment called Where is Our Girl? If you want more information on Mark de Fuita, you can click here to go to his website. He's also on Twitter at, with the address at Mark de Fuita. Where is Our Girl? The first entry in the series of Facebook entries is from Helen Chan, our girl's mother. Please share this photo of our girl. Tell all your friends to help us find Tam and I, Jinga police, uh, help us look for her. She wearing white school shirt and blue pinafore dress. She not there when Lo Gong go pick her up from school today. She don't have phone with her. 37 people like this and 23 have shared it, among whom are the following. Eileen Tan. Ayo, sis, how can Lo keep our girl safe? I am in prayer. Susie Lee. I'm praying for her to call you all first so you know she she's all right. Please let for our girl come home. Sorry if your family must endure. Again, Susie Lee. Helen, please call me at home if there's anything I can help. Susan George says, Helen, my prayers for you and our girl safe return home. Please keep us all posted. We will continue to pray. Christine Lee, I just call you to talk to you. I know I'm over here in Penang, but I'm here for you. We have always been like sisters, and I know our lives have taken us in different places. But I love you and my goddaughter, our girl. And I'm here. Please call me. I'm so sick to stomach worrying. No judgments here. We are family. Please call me back. Helen replies. Thank everyone, and thank God she will be safe. We are all on phone right now trying to call our girl's friend. Vanessa on. My God, Helen, sharing this right now. Michael Fernandez. Praying for a quick return. Let me know if there's anything that I can do. And then he adds, shared as well. Irene Lai pipes in. Stay strong, Helen. My oldest actually did this a couple of times in her later teens. She's smart enough to know not to put herself in danger. Mine did it to punish us after being scolded for lack of effort at school. She'll be back and will be sorry for the amount of drama she's created. Your love will carry you through. Remember to breathe. Be there for each other. And soon she'll be home. Helen replies to Irene. Irene Lai, I've been just like that. Lazy girl, no good at school. How will she ever look after us in our old age if you cannot do well at school? I hope she will be more steady when she come back. If she come back, somebody please find my baby. Teach on fun. We love you, Helen and Agar. Fiona Kong, praying for you. 
Lillian Young, sending prayers your way, Fiona Kong again. Can we come to help? Helen Chan, yes, if you want to watch kids. Susie Lee, how did the phone thing go? Should we help look for her? Michael Fernandez, you need any more help to come look? Nazira Rasita, Helen, call me when you get a minute. Maybe your little girl be safe from her. Felicity Wong, need another hand with the kids? Rohas needs a family, sending my prayers your way, even we not same, all prayers are good. Elizabeth Lee, praying, Christine, mm, praying, Jennifer Tan, praying for our girl and your family, Robert Lee, oh my goodness, Helen, I can't imagine how you feel. If I can work out how to repost this, I will. I have friends that live in your area, praying for you all, XO, 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 XO. Helen Ang, praying, and Chitan, praying for her return soon, Helen. Our old KL, just not safe these days. So many foreigners, huh? Christine Chu, oh my God, praying. Evelyn Chin, my heart goes out to you. Rachel Wong, praying. Stephen Chong, praying. Mei Li, so glad you're okay. Helen Chan, our girl's mother. Thank you all. Our girl's safe at home now. And your prayers had all work. She did not go to school today. Not a girl spent all day in Mid Valley with two classmates instead. Now we will pay for tuition fees somehow so she can get good results and not let this situation happen again. If that does not work, then maybe we need to change our school. Many prayers answered today. 17 likes. Joe Manka Manicha. Just read this. So glad our girl is safe. Be well. Richard Liu. I'm so glad that all is well, Helen. We were all very sick. I can only imagine what you were going through. God answered all our prayers. And there were many of us warriors out there. Be well. Be safe. The End